Hi guys and welcome back to LEGO DC Super Villains. Uh, you may or may not know, but there has actually been a DLC release. It's for Aquaman movie. This is pack two. Uh, hopefully you've seen the Let's Play for pack one that came out just before, uh, the beginning of December. Um, and hopefully you've had a chance to watch the rest of the series. I'm going to jump straight in here. Um, it's called The Final Battle, which should pretty much give away what we're expecting to see. How's it going, small fries? Missed the best hero of them all, did you? Me and Mira had been busy looking for King Atlan's long-lost trident. Turns out it would give its holder mastery over the seas, which would be kind of useful when going up against my little bro. After a bunch of searching, running, climbing, falling, jumping, and some flying, whew, we finally got a clue to where it was hidden. I was glad to get back to swimming. <laughs> no, not that kind of swimming. Yeah, that's better. And faster. Very important when you're trying to get away from so many teeth and so many claws. But we got rid of them. Piece of yeah. fish cake. And finally, in the depths of the hidden sea, we found Atlan's trident. Ooh. Yeah! <laughs> After that, I just had to unite the Seven Kingdoms and convince them that I could be their king. But Orm wasn't going to make it easy, and the biggest water fight ever was about to start. Permission <laughs> to come to aboard? Alright, so here we are. So we've got to unite the Seven Kingdoms, which makes sense. Um, it's kind of spoiler-free, it but still part of the movie. Done, especially with Orm on our case. Freeing those fishermen would be a good place to start. More than likely. Right, so I did actually go and see the movie over Christmas. I really enjoyed it, which is very rare for me to say about a modern DC movie. <laughs> um, but yeah, it was actually really good. I really enjoyed it. Um, bit fun, bit silly in places, but yeah, well worth watching if you haven't already. Um, Anyway, uh, if you've not had a chance to watch any of the previous series, or any of the Let's Plays I've done previously, essentially from, uh, this isn't going to be a guide video, this is very much me just playing the story, I'm not looking for the mini kits, I'm not looking for the graffiti tag, even though I can see it from here, it's up there on the left. <laughs> Uh, I'm just playing through the story, um, and just it enjoying like it, so. We made ourselves some new friends. Orm didn't seem too happy about it. Probably why he sent some of his buddies after us. Okay. Ah, trench people. They're not on his side in the movie. They're also a lot scarier in the movie. <laughs> These guys look like, um, it's like a not swamp thing, but it's like a swamp type character in uh, is, it, is it Marvel? One Lego, one of the other Lego games. I've seen a character that looks just like that, but in green. Kaboom! By defeating the trench in battle, we'd won their respect. Yeah, to change sides. That was easy. Things were looking up. Oh, he's not going to be very happy with that. Orm managed to knock out the power. If we wanted to communicate with King Narius, we'd have to find a way to fix it. Fast. King Narius. Oh, that's Dolph Lundgren. Who I didn't know was in the film. Alright, I'm guessing we're going down. Seems like the way to go. Here we go. Right, what do we need to do? Destroy everything! <laughs> Alright. Oh, I didn't know she could do that. I know she I knew she could do the bubble. I didn't realise that she could uh illuminate. That's handy. Good to know for future uh future endeavours. Is that uh, that's to do with a mini kit? We're not doing mini kits. Oh, is that to do with a mini kit then? That looks like a green lantern point. Okay. So look around then. No. No. <laughs> is that 
Right, that's a, that's a power generator. Can Aquaman activate it? No, he cannot. Awesome. I'd have more luck Where's Thor when you need him? Nope, that's not working. You'd think water would do it, seeing as, uh, according to the movie, some of their technology is actually powered by water. Which makes sense if you live under the sea. Ah! Okay! I didn't know she could do that. Awesome. There you go, Mira can use um, lantern spots. Good to know. Right, let's power this baby up. Boom. So she's getting angry at her dad. Mira managed to convince <laughs> her dad to join with us. Where's the voice then? I think that was the last straw uh, for Orm. Uh oh, what's he gonna do now? Surely Orm there's a battle coming. Think too much of me winning our little popularity contest. Yeah. So it's time to teach him a lesson or two about being a king. Yeah, you tell him, Jason Mama. Or pretend Jason Mama. Right, awesome. Oh, okay. I do like Orm's new outfit compared to the uh, DLC pack one. Much better than the Gladiator outfit. Yeah! Hello! I will not die! Run! I take that back. I might die. Ah! I think that would work. Uh, did I die? Ah, oh, I did. I thought I got away with that. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> right. Ah, <laughs> right, there you go. He's down two stars. He's down by two stars, even. Two hearts. Why do I keep saying stars? Seems that Orm still had a few friends. Yeah, I know. They weren't going to make this easy. One of these guys is actually one of the uh, unlockable characters that you get, which is awesome. Boom. Take that, you! He is not easy to kill. Whoa! I'm not gonna die again. I'm not gonna die again. Boom. Right, come on, get him. Ah! You won't kill me again! Oh. I don't know, actually. One star. Can I survive it? Orm tried calling for more help, but it looked like his plans were about to be all washed up. But, ah, uh, oh. <laughs> Never mind. Right, come on. He's got one heart left. He's shooting me with water. That shouldn't do anything. There we go. Go, 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 go. One more hit. One more hit. Here we go. Boom. Is that it? Is that the end of the level already? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like that, the tides turned on or Peace returned under the sea. And I took my place as king. Yeah. Okay. So that's the end of the level. Um, not going to lie, a bit disappointed by the length. Um, I'm pretty sure that the first DLC pack was a little bit longer, uh, the Ring of Fire. But yeah, it's still enjoyable. I mean, it tied in nicely with the movie without giving away any spoilers, which is always a bonus. Um, hopefully you've enjoyed the video. Please do let me know what you think. Um, I'll be back very soon with another video. Please leave a comment. Um, let me know if you enjoyed it, if you've played it yet, um, or if you're going to get it. Uh, let me know if you've seen the movie, what you think of that, because I'll be interested to know. And uh, give us a thumbs up, and please do subscribe if you've enjoyed this video. Anyway, I'll be back very soon with another one. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.